Wood Green is a suburban district of North London, England, in the London borough of Herringy. The London Plan identifies it as one of the metropolitan centres in Greater London, formerly lying within the western part of Tottenham and within the county of Middlesex. It became part of both Herringy and Greater London in 1965. Topic. Toponymy The name Wood Green derives from Woodleg or Woodley, a Saxon word meaning open ground near a wood, which in this case relates to an opening in Tottenham Wood, an extensive area of woodland which formerly covered most of this area and westward to Muswell Hill. The earliest surviving written record of Woodleg is a reference in documentation dating from 1256, which relates to a grant for Ducats Manor, a sub-manor of Tottenham, which used to be located just to the east of the present-day Wood Green High Road, roughly opposite the junction of Alexandra Road and the High Road. Topic history records suggest that settlement around Wood Green did not start till after the Norman Conquest. There is some limited evidence of Roman presence in the Wood Green area but none of any Saxon settlement. However, from the latter part of the 14th century, a number of estates developed around Wood Green. This included the manor of ducats and a handful of smaller estates. In the early 17th century, the Lord of Tottenham Manor, the Earl of Dorset, conducted a major survey of his land. It showed that Wood Green, at the time roughly the western half of Tottenham, had only 16 houses and 50 inhabitants. At around the same time as the Dorset survey, the new river was constructed through Wood Green. Winding through the area, the river looped across Chitts Hill and then passed along the northern side of Wood Green Common before turning south. The proximity of Wood Green to the new watercourse enhanced the area's reputation and between the 17th and early 19th century, several large properties were constructed in the area, initially as country retreats for wealthy Londoners. Such dwellings included Cherson House, Wood Green Cottage, Moat Cottage and The Grange, all of which were situated on the fringes of Wood Green Common and dated from the 17th century. Later, Wood Green House c. 1780, Chitts Hill House c. 1805 and Bounds Green House were constructed at the perimeter of the common. Despite the development of these dwellings, by 1798 the population of Wood Green stood at just 100 inhabitants and remained scattered. It was centered at this period on Wood Green Common. At the same time as the population was growing so was the traffic along Green Lanes. As a result, Wood Green's first inn and recognizable business appeared. In 1770 George Chesser established a blacksmith's shop on the corner of Green Lanes and Lordship Lane later known as Spouter's Corner. In 1781, the Three Jolly Butchers Coaching Inn was opened on the west side of Green Lanes between Lordship Lane and Bounds Green Road. During the early decades of the 19th century, the number of inhabitants in the area began to increase significantly. By the middle of the 19th century the population had increased to 400 and the center of Wood Green's gravity had moved north and east with most development taking place in a triangle directly north of St. Michael's Church. By the time of the publication of the 1869 Ordnance Survey map, Clarence Road, Truro Road, Nightingale Road, Finsbury Road and Commerce Road were all laid out and were becoming increasingly built up. The opening of the Great Northern Railway Line station at Wood Green in 1859 encouraged further development. By the end of the 19th century, much of Wood Green had been built up. What remained was built over during the first part of the 20th century. 
The Victorian development was both residential and commercial in nature. Wood Green's industrial development was centered on the area bounded by Wood Green Common, the Great Northern Railway, Turnpike Lane and the High Street. Amongst the first companies to arrive in the early 1860s was E. Welch & Co. Tobacco Manufacturer. Then in short order came the Harnsey Steam Laundry, Henry A. Ivory & Co. Piano Manufacturers and Davis and & Timmins Screw Factory. In 1880, Barrett's arrived and grew to be one of the biggest confectionery manufacturers of the 20th century, as Wood Green's population grew, so did its high street. The earliest retail developments had been in Commercial Road and Finsbury Road during the 1860s. However, by the early 1880s retail activity was clearly shifting to the high road. At first, it focused on the area between White Hart Lane and Truro Road. As the population grew, retail growth south of Lordship Lane began to exceed that north of it and by the end of the first decade of the 20th Wood Green, High Street had become a popular shopping centre for North London. By 1976 Wood Green was the largest shopping centre in North London with a turnover of more than £20 million. With the reorganisation of local government in the 1960s, Herringy Council was formed from the former boroughs of Wood Green, Harnsey and Tottenham. The new unified administration wanted to reinvent Wood Green as a «heart for Herringy». It was one of a number of new suburban centres intended to counteract the pull of central London. The shopping city was constructed between 1976 and 1981. With its mall and retail developments above, it was, and remains, a gargantuan development. <laughs> <laughs> Governance history Up to the 19th century, Wood Green came under the governance of the manor and parish of Tottenham. Tottenham developed from a parish in Middlesex into an urban sanitary district in 1875, after a local board of health had been established in 1850. In 1888, the municipal borough of Wood Green was created as an urban district, and later a municipal borough, of Middlesex. In 1965, under the London Government Act 1963, the municipal borough of Wood Green was abolished and its area merged with that of the municipal borough of Tottenham and the municipal borough of Harnsey to form the present-day London borough of Herringy. The constituency of Wood Green was created in 1918 and existed until 1983 when it was split. Some of the constituency was transferred to the neighbouring seat of Tottenham, but most was merged with the Harnsey Parliamentary Constituency to form the Harnsey and Wood Green Parliamentary Constituency. Since 2015, the seat has been represented in the House of Commons by the Labour Party MP, Catherine West. Topic. Entertainment history The Alexandra Palace, which is within Wood Green Parish, played a leading role in the development of public service television. Wood Green also played its part in the history of commercial television in the UK. In 1955, with the opening of Lou Grade's London Weekend Franchise Associated Television ATV, the Wood Green Empire in Limington Avenue was home to variety programs on independent television ITV, one of which was The Arthur Haynes Show, starring the host himself and his straight man Nicholas Parsons. Only the frontage of the Wood Green Empire survives. It is now a branch of the Halifax. The now demolished bus depot at Wood Green was used for location filming by London Weekend Television for their 1970s situation comedy on the buses. <laughs> 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 
1992 bomb incident Two bombs planted by the Provisional IRA exploded at the Shopping City Complex on 10 December 1992, injuring 11 people, including four police officers. The bombs were hidden in two separate litter bins about 200 yards away from each other. Topic. Geography Wood Green stretches from Turnpike Lane in the south to the borough boundary in the north. Its eastern and western boundaries have changed over time and today people have varying senses of what exactly is included in Wood Green. One definition sees the western boundary as formed by the Great Northern Railway Line. Others argue that Alexandra Park is still within Wood Green's boundaries. Less contentious is the eastern boundary. A common definition would roughly describe it by a line running from the southwestern corner of Tottenhall Park, to the junction of the Roundway and Lordship Lane, then along Downhill's Way as far as Belmont Avenue. This part of the boundary is completed by a line running in a northwesterly direction as far as Westbury Avenue. The area rises from 66 feet 20 meters to 98 feet 30 meters above sea level. Topic: <laughs> Locale The shopping area and residential areas of Wood Green all offer quite different identities. The area to the west of the High Road, near Alexandra Palace, was developed as a mainly middle-class residential area, whereas the area to the east, towards Tottenham, mainly comprises smaller dwellings that were either built for railway workers in the 19th century or as social housing in the 20th. The High Street and the Shopping Mall host mainly low-priced shops, giving a somewhat down-at-heel air. However, behind the High Street, Wood Green streets include a high proportion of attractive high-quality Victorian houses. To the north and west of the Tube Station, a large number of green spaces weave through the streets and a number of larger open green areas remain. Topic. Town Hall The Town Hall is the civic center on Wood Green High Road. It was opened in 1958. It is a listed building, although much of the building is now unused. The civic center is the official seat of Herringy Council and contains the council chambers. Topic. Demography Wood Green does not fit neatly into wards. However, a significant part of the area is contained within the Noel Park and Woodside wards. The population of those wards is given as 28,453 in the 2011 census. The same census reports that white groups make up 55% of the population of Noel Park Ward. The figures for the Woodside Ward are 53% white and 8% black African. Topic. Economy Wood Green is a busy urban activity center with a sizable shopping area with two cinemas, bars, nightclubs, numerous restaurants and cafes and a shopping area, the mall, close to the tube station. The High Road, the main shopping spine, stretches from the Wood Green tube station to the next stop on the Piccadilly Line, Turnpike Lane, and is lined with shops along its route. It joins with green lanes at both its northern and southern ends. The Chocolate Factory was set up by Herringy Arts Council in 1996 to develop artists' studios and now has a second building. 
The project houses 200 local artists, music, film and multimedia studios, photographic studios, and several performing arts organizations. Topic. Green spaces Alexandra Park Avenue Gardens Station Road, Park Avenue Barrett Gardens Station Road, Mays Road Caxton Gardens Station Road, Mays Road Chapman's Green Lordship Lane, Perth Road Cranbrook Park, Cranbrook Park, St. Albans Crescent Crescent Gardens, High Road, Stewart Crescent Finsbury Gardens, Finsbury Road King George VI Memorial Garden, High Road, Stewart Crescent Nightingale Gardens, Bounds Green Road Riversdale Gardens, White Hart Lane, Newnham Road Russell Park, Russell Avenue Trinity Gardens, Bounds Green Road White Hart Lane Recreation Ground, White Hart Lane Wood Green Common, Station Road Woodside Park, High Road Topic 21st Century Regeneration As of 2018 Wood Green is the focus of two major regeneration programs by the London Borough of Herringy. The Herringy Heartlands Initiative covers an area to the west of the town centre, including the former Clarendon Gas Works, Olympia Trading Estate and land on Western Road. The program aims to transform the area into a mixed sub-neighborhood, with 1,700 homes, along with retail and office space. There are also plans for new public open space including a Civic Boulevard linking the east and west of Wood Green and a public square for events and activities. The wider area of Wood Green is the focus of a second significant regeneration plan entering the final stages of consultation in early 2018. The Wood Green Area Action Plan would see the transformation of Wood Green Town Centre with the creation of 6,400 new homes, 4,000 new jobs and a redeveloped town centre with a significant amount of high-rise building. Topic. Transport Topic. London Underground Wood Green Tube Station is at the northern end of Wood Green High Road and Turnpike Lane Tube Station and its southern. Both are on the Piccadilly Line. Topic. Railway Alexandra Palace is on the East Coast Main Line. It has services into King's Cross and Moorgate and out to Hertford and Welland Garden City. Bowes Park serves the Hertford Loop Line branch of the East Coast Main Line. Topic. Buses London Buses Routes 29, 67, 121, 123, 24 hour operation, weekends, 141, 144, 184, 221, 230, 232, 243, 24 hour operation, 329, N29, N91, W3 and W4 serve the area. Topic. Education For general details of education in Wood Green see the London Borough of Herringy article. Topic. Primary 
Noel Park Primary Alexandra Primary Earlham Primary Lordship Lane Primary Nightingale Primary St. Michael's C of East Primary Street Paul's R.C. Primary Rhodes Avenue Topic. Secondary Heartlands High School Alexandra Park School St. Thomas More Catholic School Woodside High School Topic. Drama Mountview Academy of Theatre Arts, a drama school located in Wood Green. Topic. Sport London Scholars is a semi-professional rugby league team that compete in the Kingston Press League One based at New River Stadium in Wood Green. They annually hold the Middlesex Nines Rugby League Tournament which also takes place at the New River Stadium. Topic. Public services Wood Green Crown Court is on Lordship Lane. Topic. Notable people See category, People from Wood Green Topic. Notable appearances Nick Hornby's book, High Fidelity Razalite's song, Los Angeles Waltz Mark Knopfler's song, Junkie Doll Pablo Gad's song Black Before Creation. Sway Dosifo's song, Up Your Speed. Juan Maria Soler's composition, Wood Green Walk, for horn and cello, 2011.